Chapter 2, The Glass Castle. Now, here's where things are really, really starting to get intense. I mean, we're only in the second area, and, uh... Yeah, let's grab ourselves a new weapon and get the hell out. We got ourselves a super shotgun. Now, um, this is, of course, familiar to all of us, uh, but the thing with this gun is that it fires either one or two shots at once. Um, it's extremely powerful, and it's very accurate, too. Uh, friggin', um, oh, come here. Come on, don't make me get hit by a friggin' barren fireball here. Ooh, it looks like a little infight's going on. We got ourselves Mancubus over there. And now we use the trees to our advantage since they're fire. Oh, this guy needs to die. And so does that guy. Gotta make sure nothing's behind us. Yep, you die. What the? Now that's what I'm talking about. There's friggin' crap everywhere. <laughs> Heal up. Heal up. Oh my god. That guy should have died like that. Okay. Mancubus. And then I think we'll be able to breathe for a moment after this guy is dead. There. Okay, uh, just gotta make sure, ah, uh, one more. Man, grab this note. And is there anybody else coming before I start reading it? All right. Ah, these things are everywhere. As far as we know, the main lab is completely overrun. We're still holding them off, but we can't do this much longer. All right, we need to heal up. And I definitely need more shells. Here's plenty right here. I think that's a waste of a box, but that's all right. You die. And now, uh, making sure... Yes, there's a friggin' Baron right there. Yeah, so if you're not used to reloading this thing, um, you better get used to it, because unless you have it on auto-reload. Ooh. In fighting? It doesn't matter. Just kill them. Okay, I think we've just about cleared out everybody. Um, possibly... Yes. Mancubus around here. Oh, what now? <laughs> That's just great. Jack, nap, man. Goodbye. So you see what I mean? Um, the intensity of these of these maps are just... Uh, it, it's nuts. Um, you have 50,000 things going on at once. So, uh... Oh, that was not... Just punch it. Yeah, okay, come on, guys. Little infighting going on.
There we go. Plenty more shells. And here's another note. Okay, I know that it's a problem. Happened not like one of the blow the console apart. Well. Uh, I like to shatter these windows here if they're not already broken. And what I'm going to do is we go in here and a couple of gray imps are going to appear um, in front of us and behind us. You die and uh, friggin' A. Friggin' reload! <laughs> Yeah, it's just a matter of, um, even if you just fire off one shot, just reload it again. I mean, it's just something that, um, you just have to get used to, I guess. And I'm still not used to it. <laughs> okay, I think we're clear. I think we're good to get the silver key now. So there's the silver key. The thing is, once we grab it and the note, um... Guys are going to just spawn in, including a Baron. He's going to appear right about here. So I dive out this window and watch out for the Mancubus as well. Let's go. Move it, move it, move it. Holy crap. And more friggin' imps. That's just hot dandy wonderful. Get the hell out of this area. Ah, uh, yeah, there's the Mancubus over here. Now everybody should be in front of me now. That, so nobody should be uh, sneaking up on me. I hope not anyways. I've got to kill this Mancubus before Baron shows up. There. There you are. There you go. Okay, I think we have one more Mancubus, unless possibly an infight occurred and he died, but I doubt that. There he is. Now he's dead. Okay, yes. Uh, as you can see, we have these mags here, these Thompson magazines. We're going to be uh, getting the Thompson pretty soon. Okay, so we ha we got our silver key and this note. If anyone reads this, please find my wife and tell her what happened. The rest is smeared with blood. This door, we need the brass key. And while things are quiet, why don't we take a look at these? Um, now, this area is actually going to become like a hub area because it's going to be where we travel to different locations of this compound. For instance, see, these doors are locked right now because it's in lockdown. Um, once we unlock the lockdown, these doors are going to open and um, we can travel to the research, weapons research and development, receiving center and airfield. Well, we can actually open this now, but we can't go back. That's where we begin. Main barracks. Power Generator Complex, and Staff Housing. Alright. Um, our next step is to go down this elevator. Is there anybody else left over? I don't think so. So we shut this door. Hit this switch. Now, down here, there's going to be three imps. What I usually do is I... I'll open the door with this, uh, fire off a t couple shots, hopefully kill one or two, shut the door again. So, open, shut the door, because uh, they're fire, I mean, we need to reload our gun. And that second of reloading could mean the difference between life and getting badly hurt. Holy crap, they opened that door. That usually doesn't happen. Well, at least these guys are all dead now. Take the little small med kit there. 
Okay, we go in here. And we find uh, a switch there. Now that switch is going to open these doors. But we don't want to do that right now. I don't suggest doing it because uh, we don't want a lot of guys coming after us. But I suggest... Get that Hell Knight. Kill them while they're inside their cells. Then... You can easily open these doors and nothing will bother you. Okay. Flip the switch and you can see um, nothing in this first one. There's a note with there's the brass key. Those things over in Central. Now I'm trapped in the cell. I had Jones lock me in here with the key, but then he went up to see what was going on and never came back. But now we have the brass key. Some more ammo and health back here. And we're good to go. Let's get our new weapon. Nice. I love it when that Mancubus kills the imp. Okay. Oh. I was gonna... You know... That's awesome. I've done this so many times too, but that guy, I don't know. There's lots of health inside this door, but there's also a Baron. Kill you quick. There. Lots of health, lots of ammo, and here is our Thompson. Whew. This weapon is... It's, you know, it's fast, but it's not really that strong. I mean, it does a good job. I'm definitely against the imps, but against things like barons and uh, mancubus, I'd prefer to use uh, the old doubler here. I got the guy inside here, right? Yeah, I did. Okay, we're just about done. We have one more hoop to jump through here, and that'll be inside here. Goodbye, Mancubus. Okay. Um, I... Yeah, we have enough shells. We should, anyways. Um, when we go in here, uh, a Hell Knight is going to appear behind us. So I usually back in and take out the Hell Knight nice and quick. He may get a shot off. Um... Oh, no. Thought he would appear there. There he is. All right. Yeah, of course we're bleeding. Just want to look for some health here. I don't want to have to go back down the elevator. That usually goes a lot smoother than that. <laughs> yeah, let's use our new weapon. Why not? We have plenty of magazines lying around. They're all going to spawn in. That's why I did that. <laughs> Here they are. They broke the windows for me. That's great. Yeah, I'd rather use this. You can't break that window, though, I don't think. Maybe they can. I'm not really sure, and I don't think I want to find out, to tell you the truth. <laughs> Alright. Uh, one more. There we go. Uh, possibly one more... Uh, yeah, one more little imp. 
Ooh wee! All right, we did it. So we have these notes. We'll just grab them all right now, and we'll read them. Um, I just want to make sure nobody's gonna sneak up on me. Okay. Ah, uh, one of three. The comm center suddenly stopped transmitting about an hour and a half ago. We have only local radios, and it is unclear exactly what is going on. I suspect a Soviet attack. We received no advance warning. Note 2 of 3. The auxiliary power cut in about 20 minutes ago. So, something must have happened to the main generator. Lieutenant Harrison was up there when all of this happened, but I haven't heard from him yet. I suspect the worst. Sergeant Malloy took a bunch of men to the armory to inspect weapons before the attack. Hopefully they're all still alive down there. Maybe they can hold out until help arrives. So there you have that, and we have this little tape deck here. That music was a bit, um, loud. I wonder if subtitles will... There we go. They hit a this afternoon. Everyone is scattered all over the place. We weren't prepared for this kind of thing, and no one has a goddamn idea what to do. I have no choice but to lock down Central or we'll be overrun. We can't hold this place. We'll probably back to the receiving center and try to protect the airfield. Oh, fuck. Something's happening. Yeah. Stop this thing. All right. So, um, we're done. All we have to do is uh, turn off the lockdown. So we hit the switch. Then we hit this one. And that's it. Um, all done. As we walk through this door, it ends. You can see from the map that you now have opened up the tunnels in this area. You are able to access a large portion of the 46A research station. The map indicates that an old base from the war is still standing to the east, and there is a small chance that it may contain a working radio. You should be able to reach this base through the barracks area of the 46A complex. You should also check out the power generator complex, as you may need to try and restore additional auxiliary power in order to access all of the restricted labs. If there is infested a central transit, it's going to be damn near impossible. But if you want to go home alive, you need to find out what the hell is going on here. 